we had come down here to this area because if you see over here there's there's this old building old bust up windows seniors today they want those beauty shots but you want to bring in a little bit of edge too because that that's just what they like they're fun they're smart they want personality so although we do get those beautiful beauty shots we want something that's just a little bit edgy too we were down here for gracie's first shoot and we got some cute stuff stuck her in the little doorway use the little brick you know you change your angles around what can i get and and then you turn and start to go but have a sweep around to kind of show what's going on around in here and um it's not something that you think okay well we got our spot that we wanted and did anything kind of come to mind when you saw that little sweep? Was this something that you thought, oh, that'd be good? Well, I turned around and what I saw was this old rusty patinaed metal gate, fence, whatever you want to call it, and some cool little weeds. So immediately the hair stood up on my arms and I got like these little, my crazy started kind of, you know, a little bit. And I said, oh, 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 oh. And if you ever hear that, that you may, you know, it's something good. Something good is gonna come from that, or we hope anyway. So I turned and I saw that and I had her sit down. In the midst of all this, cars going on, uh, lo, you know, electrical poles, uh, train track, uh, old broken down cars, and yet you're given this little gift of this really, really, really old fence. So I'm gonna show y'all what we did and what we can get from it. Gracie, if you don't mind, go and take a seat. Now, because we're in harsh sunlight, now get up a little bit closer to that um, weed if you can. You're probably gonna have some some stuff sticking. Now, we've got this harsh sun here, so of course we're gonna want a diffuser or something, but we also wanna watch that that diffuser's not gonna really take off my shadow off the ground, so I have to kind of maneuver around and see what I can do. So as I'm positioning her, I'm, I'm seeing this shot in my mind. I wanna go ahead and figure out what I'm doing, where her arms are gonna go in the shot, how her head's gonna go in the shot, and you know, what my settings need to be, stuff like this. So I would generally do a diffuser, but for this one, for the sake of it being quick and easy, we're gonna go ahead and get get the reflector, actually. Okay. Now, this is not gonna be optimum, and I'll actually cheat and show y'all the shot that we got originally. You'll see that my weed back there, our little happy weed, you know, as Bob Ross might say, our little happy weed back there was really lots prettier when we shot the first time. So, because I don't like that really definite, hard, hard, hard light there, I'm gonna move in a little bit and not necessarily get the arms, okay? So I'm still down at about 1.8. We got our eye lighter up under there, and Gracie is all light relaxed. Jenny, if you will, come in closer. Now, I wanna get just that face. Close your eyes a minute. Oh gosh, y'all, people. Okay, oh, let the crazy out. I told y'all, I try to do this in increments, but when I get excited, y'all just have to, I hope photography gives y'all as much joy as it does me. Oh, see, oh, oh. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> well, here we go. Oh, I'm sorry. My friend Jason has a way to do this. Oh. I have got to watch his video on how to do this. <laughs> Let's not because... video me doing it. <laughs> Well, <laughs> there is something. Oh, it's so much fun. Let's see here. 